Hey guys, so today we are going to be doing a tutorial on this card. It was inspired by this card. I just changed a few things as I don't have access to all the codes that were used in the reference. So yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and get started. So for the cursor, I have linked in the description a website with as many pixels as one person could ever need. Um, and you're just going to want to save whatever pixel you want to use, upload it to Dropbox, which is a free service you can use, and then copy the link from Dropbox. And I don't have Dropbox open, so I'm just going to copy the link from the reference card. And when you paste it, paste it where I'm pasting it here, and then you're gonna wanna change, it's gonna say www, change that to dl, and then at the very end, add .gif. For the background as well, you're just gonna wanna change the heart to a mark, unless you want it to be a heart or another symbol like a star. The TV effect, it's so easy. You literally just have to copy and paste it and not change anything. I just added it because it gives the image like kind of, well, a CV effect and I think it adds to the card, but this is completely optional. I did want to make note that it is very important you add the elements in the order that I've specified in the Google Doc as well as the order I'm doing it in the tutorial just so that all the elements turn out how they, how they are supposed to.
The text I just added is optional, but I think it just um, spaces out the container with the music in it and like makes it look more even, places the music player directly in the middle. It is really important that you add these containers at the very end once you've done everything else. I mentioned that in the Google Doc, so there isn't really any way to be confused about that. Um, the card isn't completely ruined if you don't, obviously. You would just have to change the element IDs in um, the main code, which is just uh, annoying, to be honest. Like, it's just a hassle. So if you do it in order, you won't have to. Anyways, um, for the music player, you can go ahead and I'll leave a link in the description of the website I use to download songs and then you can upload that to Dropbox and like you did with the cursor you're going to change www to dl and at the end instead of .gif you're going to add .mp3 and right up here is where you will change the lyrics. As for the links, it's very simple. You're going to want to put the name of your link here and then the actual link itself here and like you can change the title if you want. I've left all my info in it to kind of act as like a template for you guys, but obviously you would want to change them to your own socials and whatnot. Alrighty, and here is what your final result should look like. The song should play. I'm not going to play it, obviously. And if you click any of these, it'll take, it'll, you know, take the person viewing your card to your socials. And yeah, I think it turned out super cute. You can obviously, I'm using the Minecraft font, but you can obviously change the font to your liking. So yeah, that's about it. And oh, I guess one thing you can do, so if you don't want like the underline when you have it, you can make the hover white. That is just like a small thing I forgot to do. But again, it's, it's really not necessary. I just think little stuff like that um, and the transparent text kind of just add to your overall card. But yeah, that's about it. Let me know if you have um, any questions, need any help. Sorry, I, I stutter a little bit when I explain things, but hopefully it's easy to follow. Um, and, you know, as usual, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.